a local high school student's working to make big changes when it comes to health care. Kelsey McGee explains his own medical struggles made him aware of the need. Kirk Lord is going into his senior year at Summit High School. He's working to get a national bill approved requiring insurance coverage for an autoimmune disease known as PANDAS. I talked with my parents at the beginning of the year. I was like, I really want to have a big like impact on the world. I really want to start doing good things. Kirk Lord was diagnosed with pediatric autoimmune neuropsychiatric disorder in 2010. It's associated with strep infection and also known as PANDAS. If you just looked at pictures of him, he just looked gray. Like uh, his eyes were gray, yeah. his skin was gray. He just looked sick. He was able to get intravenous immunoglobulin therapy, also known as IVIG therapy, to help with his symptoms like ticks, OCD, and anxiety. Long-term disease. Like this yeah. is a journey for families and yeah. these kids. So it's it's not like you snap your fingers and you're done. You know, have you have IVIG and you're done with it. It's, you know, symptoms improve. Uh, can can improve drastically is what we saw and then but later on he needed another round of that. IVIG gives a person antibodies to fight infections when their body is not producing the antibodies. The average cost of an infusion is more than nine thousand dollars. Recently the Oregon State Legislature passed Senate Bill 628. It requires health benefit plans and health care service contractors to cover treatment for pandas and will take effect next year. Lord wants to take it a step further and create a national bill to require insurance coverage for kids who need IVIG therapy. There's like hundreds of thousands of kids across the United States with pandas who can't get the treatment because it's just, they just don't get insurance coverage. Kirk says he is currently in touch with an assistant to Senator Ron Wyden, and he has a history of making a difference. When he was younger, he raised $6,000 for Panda's research by crossing the Golden Gate Bridge on a pogo stick without stopping. If we can get this bill passed, these kids can lead full lives and reach their full potential and make a huge mark on the world. Kirk created a survey for students to get support for the bill. It would provide health coverage for Panda's patients across the country. Kelsey McGee, News Channel 21.